Hello, my name is Sam and I'm a network technician at Twin Lakes. Today, we'll be talking about internet trouble and how to identify when you need to reboot your router. First, let's identify the main components that provide your internet connection. From the main box on the outside of your house, also known as the ONT, if this comes directly through the floor or wall, this ethernet cable must be connected directly into the WAN or internet port on the back of your router. Otherwise, if you have an ethernet jack, then there should be a cable running from this jack to the WAN or internet port on the back of your router. If you have a Twin Lakes router, it will be a black box with a Zizel logo on it. If you have a third party router, it may look a little bit different. Even third party routers have WAN ports and internet ports that will be very similar to that of a Zizel router. If you were ever to experience any issues, such as an inability to load a web page, slow Wi-Fi, or trouble connecting to the Wi-Fi, you may need to reboot your router. The best way to reboot your router is to remove the power source from it for around 10 to 20 seconds. This can be done by unplugging the router from the wall outlet or by simply removing the power cable from the back side of the router. This will be a small, round, black cable that should be plugged into the DC-in outlet on the back of the router. After this has been disconnected for about 10 to 20 seconds, you can plug it back in. After about two to five minutes, the router should be booted up. After this time has elapsed, we can try and connect the device to make sure it's functioning properly. If you're still having trouble at this point, make sure that your device is connected to the Wi-Fi by going to the settings menu on your device. Generally, there will be an option within the settings menu that says network settings or Wi-Fi settings. By going into this menu, you should be able to see some sort of indication that the device is connected to the wireless network, such as a check mark. If there is no indication, Try to tap or click on your Wi-Fi network name if it is listed in the menu to see further information. It may ask for the security key, which will be your Wi-Fi password. If it does, type in your Wi-Fi password and click on Next or Connect. This should allow for connectivity from your device to your Wi-Fi network. If you continue to have issues with this, please contact Export. Thanks for watching and have a great day.